Good afternoon, Ethan Colm here at Alderman's Toyota where your satisfaction is our top priority. I want to thank you for your inquiry on this beautiful 2024 Toyota Tundra Platinum. Um, this is a, the iForce Max engine. Uh, so this is a twin turbo V6 with a, a hybrid powertrain as well, um, giving you a combined horsepower of 476. Uh, it's a real powerhouse, great for towing, um, and also looks pretty sharp too. Um, that engine is mated to a 10-speed automatic transmission with uh, tow modes and a couple other things that we'll get into shortly. Um, this being the platinum trim, you get all the bells and whistles. On the front, you get this special uh, looking grill that's gonna be that sort of a grayish color. When I go through and unlock it, you can see you have those special lighting right there. You have LED lights throughout. Um, coming over to the right, you can see you have your uh, parking detectors. That's what that little sensor right there is for. Uh, the iForce Max engine signifying that this is the hybrid. Um, you have those big disc brakes down here with uh, ventilated uh, rotors. And the platinum trim does get that sharp looking uh, different wheel right there. Um, the fender arch right there has that black color change. It actually looks pretty sharp. Uh, and coming over to the right here, you have the uh, color keyed mirror right there uh, with uh, also the little blinker built right in, blind spot monitoring built into them. And again, signifying that this is a platinum trim, you do have the platinum logo right there with a the long stripe going down the middle. Um, coming over to the back here, you have that black chrome exhaust tip. Uh, Tundra four wheel drive. This is a crew, ca uh, crew max with the five and a half foot bed. I'll go through and show you this. Proximity lock and unlock, soft drop tailgate. The rain is starting to come in, so I'm gonna go through and hop in the back here pretty soon. But you have this uh, aluminum, uh, composite aluminum reinforced bed, and this one does have the spray on bed liner. You do have a uh, plug in in the back there for anything you want to uh, plug in. And also the deck rail system. They go through, send this back up. There also is buttons right on the side here for dropping the tailgate, which is actually pretty neat. Um, and also you can see that bed step comes out and they're able to hop in the back. And there's also power uh, running boards as well. Let me go through, close this. In the back, as you can see, you got these door edge guards. Oh, let me go through. Proximity lock and unlock on the uh, two front doors, but we'll unlock here with the key. Smart key system, push button start. This is the uh, Softex um, vegan leather. As you can see in the back here, you have uh, heated and ventilated rear seats charge cables down there. Um, also, this does have, I'll show you in the back here, the uh, premium JBL uh, subwoofer there. All weather floor mats already installed and a real premium look and finish on the inside of this cab. Also, check this out. A little bit of a privacy shade. All right, let's hop in. Grab bar and power running boards. Nice cabin to be in. Loads and loads of room in the crew cab. As you can see, my knees Bunch of space, same thing when it comes to headroom. Big bench seat in the back, which is theater type seating, so you're a little higher up than the front seats. Uh, and as you can see from the back here, you do have a little bit of ambient lighting. Down there, there's that blue lighting coming from inside the vehicle. Uh, I'll hop up in the front after we go over a couple little things. So check this out. You have this huge uh, panoramic glass that does move up in the front, and this whole thing can be covered too as well. Um, Favorite feature is probably that big display right there, that 14 inch display that's gonna have your Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. Um, you also have a Qi wireless charger down below. So while the rain picks up, I'm gonna hop up in the front, turn on the vehicle. We'll go over some of the features that it has. So this being the platinum trim, you get this blue stitching throughout on all the seating and you get all the bells and whistles. Um, also these uh, mirrors, when you lock the door, they actually collapse in on themselves. Um, Eight-way power adjustable with a uh, little bit of a uh, movement right there. Completely customizable uh, when it comes to the seating position in this vehicle. Uh, you really, there's no way it's not going to be comfortable. Um, also, you have a power movement right here for the, oh, a little bit of lightning. Power movement for the steering wheel as well. All right, hopping in. Push button start. Integrated trailer brake controller down there. Get the AC blasting and the ventilated seats for me and also the passengers right here. You have a big display right here, all physical buttons for going through and adjusting the HVAC. No need to go through the screen, which I really appreciate. 
Uh, I'm going to go through dual zone climate control. So I'm going to set this to 68 degrees and then press the sync button right here and it should sync up the entire vehicle. Apologize for all the, uh, the wind noise. It's just so hot in here. Um, down to the left, you have your heated seats, uh, your AC controller, and the ability to turn off the uh, running boards, keep them just out, close them, and through there. Uh, gas button there. Um, that's how you change the brightness for the uh, big display right here. Fully digital display that's completely customizable. Um, this vehicle does come equipped with radar cruise control, lane departure warning, and pre-collision detection. It's Toyota Safety Sense 2.5 Plus, um, so it's going to have pretty much your whole suite. Um, also automatic lights, um, you also have automatic high beams, four wheel drive on demand modes down here, and uh, trailer modes, and a 360 camera, which is super cool to see. Um, it's kind of hard to see because of the rain, but uh, you can see right there, this vehicle does also have a heads up display, which is super sharp. Um, you also do have this, in case you have passengers in the back, it's a uh, camera operated um, rear view camera. but just normal modes with the home link as well, but put it back into that camera mode. Um, also, you'll have these uh, cool modes, so you can actually look down and you see you have that uh, predictive path of travel. Um, also here you can see the turbo boost gauge and the battery gauge for the uh, hybrid electric engine. Um, and also whenever you put it into reverse, those mirrors move down just a bit to give you a little bit more uh, views on your uh, rear view. Uh, all right, so again, accent lighting right there, accent lighting down below, nice blue cup holders inside here as well. Um, bunch of space inside here for wherever you'd want to put in there. Let's go through. I'm going to try to stay out of the rain, but let's take a look at the rest of the vehicle. I'm going to turn on these lights all the way too, so you get a look at those LED headlights and that bed stuff really coming in handy right there so LED tail lights this color is just absolutely gorgeous this is the wind chill pearl LED lighting pretty much everything that's a light on this vehicle is LED coming around to the right here is that window sticker a couple different things 20 inch dark painted alloy wheels um, 2.3 inch digital meter in there the lever leather trims actually you know what these seats are leather trim, not soft tex. I was incorrect. So they're leather trimmed seats. Um, also right inside here, special color and the stainless steel. Uh, what is that? Stainless steel door edge guards. Oh, these ones right here. Those are stainless steel. All right. And there is the MSRP price down there. All right. Let's take a look at this really, really iconic front end of the Tundra. The new Tundra looks super sharp. LED headlights. Uh, and also those DRL bars too. Um, honestly, a really cool looking package. My favorite truck that we have today. All right, that's gonna do it for me. I'd like to thank you for watching. Um, if you'd like to learn more about pricing and availability of this vehicle, please visit the link down below to our website where you can find out more about that. But if you're in the Rutland neighborhood, come on down to Route 7 South here and come take it for a test drive. I've been Ethan, thank you so much for watching.